yes, this is the main gate of Makere University College of Health Sciences, where the university and then the hospital have the common entrance. As you can see, entering the gates, you see the entrance and then the wall that separates the university from the hospital, which we call Berlin Wall. Yes, this is the signpost that shows that it's Makero University College of Health Sciences. And as I talk, we are in Marago, Marago Hill. This is where the college is located, unlike other colleges that are on Makere Hill. On entering the college itself, this is how it looks like as we start with the first building, which is the first school. This is the School of Public Health, where the environmental sciences, the public health itself, where they study from. This is the main building of it, where the offices are located on the entrance. Yes, this is the school, and you can see beside this, it's the parking of the School of Public Health. And then on the ground floor, it's where we find the offices located and up their classes and lecture rooms where students study from. This school was established a long time ago as backed dates in 1922. Yeah, this is the wall I was talking about. Uh, why not about the signposts? Yeah, it was a, a political season. It was a season of elections, so students had to put their, their posters on the walls. But this is the Berlin Wall, which separates the actually the College of Sciences from Marago National Hospital which is behind there and the Berlin Gate is in front there we shall look and we see uh, opposite the Marago Hospital is this very beautiful building which is very big and large which has a school of medicine which is actually the mother school in this college yes this is the Berlin Gate the gate that separates or oh, that helps students enter that behind the building, you see, it is the part of National Hospital Morago. Uh, so the students enter this gate and then enter the college and back forth. So this is where the, this actually this is the main gate that separates the school from the hospital. It's called the Berlin Gate. It had been closed for a long time, but now of recent was opened and actually it is helping students to ease the movements. This is what we call the Dean's Garden. The Dean's Garden is a place where actually the students of medicine and surgery and other schools come and converge, sit, have a chat, and relax from the worries of the day. It's, uh, it's covered with trees, and actually it is the biggest compound we have in a school of medicine, and actually a college as large as you can see it. Within the Dean's Garden, we have this stone. As you can see, it is Sir Ian William James MacAdam. Actually, this was the professor of surgery in Murago Hospital and was actually teaching lecturer here. He's actually the father of surgery, if I can say, here in Makere University. He's the person who, he was the person who came from, He comes from South Africa, as you can see the stone says. He was here from 1953 to 73 and actually was chased away by Amin Dada, the president by then, and he went into exile. This is School of Medicine building. It has actually the offices of School of Medicine. The Dean sits there. The Academic Register of School of Medicine sits there. And actually it is a very nice building. It has most of the offices. And actually the upper floor, that's where we have the skills lab. Today being a weekend, actually it is a Sunday evening, most of the offices are closed and we cannot enter these buildings. However, there's this actually beautiful thing. The booth cafe. This is where the students actually have their small breakfast. Those who have little money, those who like parkings, they park from here. It is actually just beside this corridor. This corridor is called the Flesher's Corridor. This is where the students usually be uh, and then chat from. We have the Wi Fi beside this, and then this is where the students be tapping Wi Fi by the from. For those who be freshers next year, actually, you can also chill from here. They don't pay. This is the extension of the students. See? Of the Dean's Garden, sorry. So you can also sit here and chill. Beside this is another building, which is actually the microbe building or biomedicals, which hold the offices and the labs of biomedicals. We have the pathology lab down, we have the microbiology, and then we have molecular biology. The uppermost floor contains the molecular biology lab, which is actually the biggest lab 
of moisture bridging in East Africa. It has actually the bio data. If we get a chance one day, we shall move up and see how it looks like for those who have never been there. This is the Davis Lecture Theatre. Actually, this is the I think the main hall which we can say yes, uh, where the most lectures take place. Uh, it was established back then, 1945, and it has been existing in condition like this. Uh, you have seen clips moving around, even Id Amin Dada, who was the once a president of Uganda, addressed the doctors one day in this building. It is a nice one, but as I told, this is a weekend and it is an evening. Actually, it is closed. One day you get a chance and see, and see how it looks like. It actually shows the beauty of Makere University and School of Medicine at large. This is the School of Biomedicals I have shown you already. Behind, it's behind side, but this is the main front. And I told it has the, the, most of the labs of biomedicals. It has a pathology lab, microbiology lab, and actual molecular biology lab. It has also lecture theaters where students can sit down, revise, and actually attend their lectures at home. It's a nice building and it's an iconic one which usually be seen actually on the Facebooks and what show the medical school. Actually behind it, it's where the actual the legendary Sir Albert Cook Library, where it starts from. This is where the, actually the main entrance. You enter from here and then enter this building. It extends far backwards and is very big. This is actually the only medical school, the, the, sorry, the medical library we have around. And actually across the country, this is the biggest. And I think it may be the biggest in East Africa. It extends backwards and actually has the handwritten notes of this man, Sir Albert Cook, who actually started the medical school here back then, 1917. Yes, this is the physiology lab. It is very big. There are four, there are four laboratories, sorry. Lab 1, Lab 2, Lab 3, and Lab 4. Uh, beside the other side, we see far away, it is called PLT, Physiology Lecture Theatre, where actually students attend lectures from. And then when you come like this opposite it, we have this big lab, which is called Anatomy Laboratory, where we have our cadavers and we dissect from. And like other universities, by the way, here at Mackay University, very few people on one cadaver. And actually we learn by touching. We don't, we are, we are not dissected before, we just dissect by ourselves. Besides it, there's this building that is in white, or I can see a creamy color, and that is the extension of this Anatomy Lab. It is for actually the postgraduate students, and it is very big, it has very many rooms, and we do exams actually from there also. Then beside this, that's the continuation of the Arbat Cook Library, and then besides you can see, actually School of Biomedicals, and then you see the DLT, Davis Lecture Theatre, and below you see the some extension of the Dean's Garden, and then Marago Hospital, you see it behind their side, and back here. This is actually how it looks like, how it is congested, but it's very nice because we have enough space for our students. Actually, as you see that building that starts from here is Family Medicine Department. This is where we learn our family medicine from. And besides it, we have the main offices of the college. We have the principal's offices. This building is very big and extends behind there, as you can see. Yeah, that's a school of medicine. That is Family Medicine, sorry. And then head of department offices, you climb from those stairs and go up. The offices are actually up. Actually, as I enter this part, we have the optometry and vision teaching clinic in this building. This is the behind part of anatomy lab and has an extension. Uh, it continues like that. The upper part is called ALT. It is anatomy lecture theatre, as you continue like that. So when you come on this side, you have this building. You can see the poster. It is College of Health Sciences School of Medicine Department of Medicine Annex. So this is the annex part, this is the building where offices actually of medicine itself as a department are found. Actually students study from Chirudu, where they study medicine from, and some part they study from Morago. Yes, as you can see, actually behind the department of medicine, actually we have the optometry and vision science teaching clinic, it is here. And besides it, you can see. You go in the Morago Hospital, but the first buildings are the Office of Psychiatry, and then this is the pediatric, pediatric ward, and then this is the pediatric actual department. The offices are from this building. When you continue this way, you are entering actually the behind part of the hospital. Yes, the most behind the part, or as you climb the hill, actually up Morago Hill, you have this building, which is actually Department of Biochemistry. It's a very big building, it extends behind, as you can see. 
and all the offices of biochemistry it has labs of biochemistry and active element discoveries have been done in this building if you can remember the first person C plus to gland is actually you saw them in this building if you can see it if you have that actually if you know that part of history this is a building actually this part the other building you can see up and all these ones this is the department of pharmacology and then this is where actually the lectures take place this is where the headquarters of pharmacology take place those who know pharmacology they know pharmacology yes that pharmacology is the pharmacology i mean the headquarters are here this is the place the other upper building all of it there are offices and actually there are some labs yes this is the entrance as you enter there yeah, that's the department of medical instrumentation where they do optics and whichever things actually very rare students actually very few know this department because not everyone studies from here yes this is the pediatric ward jelf which is nearby the school so it is part of the school itself you remember i told you that we have the sir albert cook library which is the biggest in east africa and has the handwritten actually the notes of sir albert cook himself which he wrote down because by then when he was here there are no typewriter there are no textbooks so what he did was to copy what was in head his head on two papers such that actually students can learn from his handwritten and get knowledge from first hand so this is the extension it continues this far away you remember i had showed to you before as I was climbing the hill because this school is on the hill so this the extension it runs up to this side as you can see but the main gate is the other side I showed you that faces into the college here I'm, I'm behind the college actually because if you can see up that is the specialized women hospital which is actually the best in the country and then behind we have the Garroway and then as you move up we have the actually the ISS clinic that is the HIV clinic up as you move up what is we have the, uh, the cancer institute this is the behind part of microbiology labs and they move like that and I think our tour, shall, we, our tour will end here actually I've always wanted to do this video but I don't know I've tried as hard as possible to make it actually possible for you people you can see up the Garroy house and the women's hospital specialized one yeah you must have noticed that actually I met very few students in this college today because the video was taken on Sunday evening and actually students expect to be in their rooms reading preparing for the week actually others are in the community others on ward so the college was almost empty yeah students don't sleep here students actually sleep in the main campus and actually move to Morago every day this is the Mulago Hill. This is the preview of the medical school. As you can see it, I think I will stop here. I've always wanted to do this video for you guys so that you know actually how medical school at Makere University looks like. Uh, my camera may not be that good, but I promise to better my best. And actually, actually, uh, it will depend on the feedback I'll get. I'll make for you more videos. And then actually open the buildings we look what is in the buildings how the labs are arranged how the offices look like we take the interviews with the people there the head of departments the best surgeons you have heard of the medical doctors yeah we shall move also to the teaching hospitals we have we have the we have four teaching hospitals with that is Morago, kawempe chiruldu and butavika mento so students move every day in the buses to those hospitals and actually here in the medical school itself we usually have the biomedicals only. I think I will stop here and I remain rare here. Yeah, a medical student here also who has struggled the fifth year.